So please, can can you have a seat? I have just a couple of uh, things to ask both of you. First of all, uh, you know, your wedding was a uh, during the pandemic, right? Post pandemic, yeah, just, getting just getting out of it. But your wedding was, I think, uh, the reels from your wedding were just on the social media from all across. You know, everyone, I think. People have seen the live footage of your wedding from minute to minute. So what was going through in your mind when you were actually getting married? Whether you were tensed about, you know, the people or the trolls who were saying so many things or you were in the moment enjoying the stuff. What was going in your mind at that time? I was very happy and not bothered about anything what people are saying because I was in the moment. And Actually, I'm surprised that you say it because as far as I know, almost everyone was very happy with our wedding. I didn't see Did he say you were trolled? Did he say you were trolled? If okay, we were trolled. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. as much as I, I know, I think it was, a, it was a beautiful moment. Yes, everything was on social media. Even though we tried it not to be, but then it was not in our control. But it was just a beautiful day. You know, I think I'd just like to say something. Uh, the kind of coverage that we got, there's a lot of media present over here. Uh, had we gone to pay for that kind of a coverage, I think though Pans crore rupees will be I just sorry, I'm being going to I'm going to be very very honest with everybody. Uh, and uh, honestly, what we felt after the wedding that media treated it as their own wedding. ऐसा लग रहा था कि उनके किसी घर की शादी है. You know, and they they were covering everything with a touch of warmth, and it was very very up close and personal. That's what I really liked about it. Great. And you had a very intimate wedding, right? Uh, Maxim, how many people were there? Uh, uh, we wanted to have 50, mm -hmm. but I think we had 200. So. And that no, no, we can't say, sorry. There were not 200 people. 200. No, but not at one. We divided them in each function. Like, because it was right after the pandemic, there were so many rules. Uh, we had to bifurcate, like, this function mein itne log aap sirf yaha aa sakte, yaha nahi aa sakte. So, function passes bana ke dehe aapne kya kya kya? Actually, you want to tell them about the invites? Oh God. Our invites, um, we were sending people the invites just a night before our wedding also. Yeah, our okay. cards were not ready or they were ready but our guest list was not ready. We didn't know who to invite, how to divide so we were in a chaos at that time and we were inviting people to please come to our wedding. Literally, <laughs> yaar, kal aja na hai, please, aisa, aisa, itne baje function hai. So we had about four functions and that's, what, uh, that's how we had divided it. But uh, I think more than the wedding, I want to talk about my friend Megha Izrani. Everybody can we hear a big round of applause for her, please? Saisha, can we hear a big round of applause? Thank you. So, so I just want to thank Megha for doing this book. And I have read it. I was a part of her Bangalore launch also. I don't know where she is. But yes, we were there together. Uh, I have read a few chapters of the book. I think it's just amazing. Uh, I think uh, what she's put in there, though Yash wanted a little bit of masala, and Yash was always saying that there is no masala, it's a little bit more masala, it's a little bit more masala, but I think what she's uh, written is just fantastic, and uh, I want to thank her because she's one of the, she's one of my go-to for everything in life, and not from today, since about 10-12 years now. In fact, the whole family, uncle is right there, looking fantastic like Rishi Kapoor in <laughs> white coat, and auntie and Yash and everybody in love. They're all great friends. Uh, their family has been actually one family. Uh, they've been part of every happiness, every sorrow that we've gone through. So I really want to, I owe them a lot of things. So uncle, auntie, Mega, Yash and love, love you. Thank you. Great. Now after 13 months of your wedding, what is one essence that you want to, uh, you know, talk to uh, with all these people and what has changed you? What has changed in 13 months of being married? So I want to tell one thing to all the men. Please choose uh, your wife to be an actor. Uh, because she'll leave home early in the morning. And she'll come back home only at 10 and 11 at night. But like we're still dating. We're still actually dating, honestly. But khair, ye masti ke baat ho gaya. I want to be honest with you. Uh, I think it's great to be having busy partners. You do your thing, I do my thing. And just be happy. Uh, when she comes home, uh, I think it's just amazing. We have so much to talk to. And it's nice. Abhi Ganpati just gaye hain. So all these years, there was only my mom at my place. But now it was her. She did the decor. She made sure the guests were served, modaks and everything. I think it's just fantastic. I would really totally recommend marriages. Uh, though I was thinking for a long time if I want to get married or not. 
this boys you know I was coming to that question you know you took a long while to decide whether you get want to get married or not yeah because you know um, I got married very early in that case <laughs> really you took a lot of time I'm not sure 26 hours. तुम्हें पता होना है बढ़िया मिला है कोई तो कर लेना चाहिए। So I think I think the banter is gonna go on with them. Okay. Hi Sonakshi, how are you? And Disha, you tell me what was one thing that actually made you jump, you know, the cliff with this gentleman here? You know, I feel. तुम जो भी कहोगी सच कहोगी सच के सिवा मैं सच ही कहती हूँ। I think when the person is right, everything just feels right. And you're just ready. There's no right age or wrong age or it's too early or it's too late. No, when you find that right person, I mean, it is all just smooth and beautiful. Even on the day of wedding, I remember everyone was saying, are you nervous? Why? And I'm like, no, I'm so chill. I'm so happy. I was laughing, dancing. Our wedding film that Megha uh, Israni photography wedding made. Film. <laughs> wedding film. that we made. Uh, we are just laughing the whole time. There's not even one single drop of tears from my eyes. So, I think it. I yeah, I was thinking, girls are crying. Yeah, yeah. That means they are going to leave home. They are laughing. So, but honestly, I think it is just amazing. And I want to tell one thing about how I actually decided to take the plunge. Because uh, so she was accompanying me for one of my shows in Udaipur. It was at a beautiful uh, restaurant. Which one is it? Udaipur. 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 So we were, uh, you know, I sang one day. Next day we stayed back because the family requested to please stay back for the wedding. And the next day there was. Uh, you know, Karan Johar and a lot of media honkos and the head honkos of a lot of, you know, these people were there. And so she was seeing all that and she asked me one question, Ki, will you do this at your wedding also? So I got attacked and I thought that day, oh, in my mind, my marriage is different from my marriage is different. So that is the time I told myself, Ki, okay, if you don't like, formalize things now, she'll be gone. And a lot of times, you know, people around you make you realize that, you know, what you've been waiting for is her. So it was. Mm. 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 So, so I have a lot of friends over here. Was it Bhavik? That's the action. So uh, Bhavik was definitely no. I won't give him credit. I say. <laughs> but Amit Bosley was uh, one of the first ones to tell me that we were actually in Goa. We were actually taking a holiday around New Year's in 2018. I think. You 18? Huh? 18, 19, beginning. 18-19. So that's when you know we were actually jet skiing at the W in Goa, and he was like, "Ki bhai, iska wait kar rahe ho?" And we're just talking, you know. All these things. Now I get to know now. Pehle toh I was so clueless. You never told me all this. Yes, ki jagahon pe mujhe pata chalti hai. Again, you know they they're so cute. They start with kitchen talks anywhere in life. Okay. Kuch toh chize natural honi chahiye because you know people are done. You know everybody there are content creators over here. I think it's not natural to Alex, is it not? Alex does one thing very, very nice. I think we should have him on stage. Okay, one, one thing I would like to ask you. You, you, like, you are a, a performer which has done too many weddings in this whole fraternity of wedding industry. What is the most absurd request that has come your way? Well, uh, nothing that I can think of right now. But there are different sorts of people who like various kinds of music, right? Uh, and not, there's ne there can never be two people liking the same song at one point. But I think it's all in good faith. It's all in a great mood, great vibe, because you're there to enjoy and have a good time. And you're there to celebrate the two people, celebrate the two families. Because in India, weddings is not only about the two people, but it's about the two families coming together. And which is really, really very, very important. That dialogue I had saved for mine when it was going to happen. Yeah. But I've already put it in my show reel. So, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, a big round of applause for Rahul and Deepa.